Allow me to give you an acronym that will give you an idea of the flow of the Old Testament. The acronym is My Basket. And if I were to write it out, it would be a capital M, a small Y for my, and then a capital B, a small A, a capital S, a capital K, a capital E, and a capital T. It's those capital letters that are really important. My basket. M stands for mankind, and that is found in Genesis chapter 1, verses 1 through 11. The B stands for beginnings, meaning the beginnings of the nation of Israel. It starts in Genesis chapter 12 and actually goes through the entire book of Malachi. B is for beginnings. When God called the patriots, Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, and gave them a promise of things to come. The S stands for settlement, the settlement of Israel, when Joshua took the people into the land of Israel. The K stands for the kingdom period, and there was a united kingdom period and a divided kingdom period. In fact, that's when most of the Old Testament books were written. The E stands for exile, as a result of the rebellion of both Judah in the south and Israel in the north, God removed Assyria, uh, removed the northern kingdom of Israel in 722 BC by the Assyrians, and then he removed Judah, the southern kingdom, in 586 BC when he brought Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, in and uh, destroyed the city. But then after the exile, there is a triumphal return of the people of Israel to the land. So just think in terms of my basket and you'll have the flow of the Old Testament. Thanks for listening.